Hi friends. Today I wanted to put together a very short video on a timely topic. You've almost certainly heard about the tragic story about the Ocean Gate submersible incident at the site of the Titanic wreckage in the Atlantic Ocean and the loss of the five souls on board. It appears the vessel they were in imploded within hours of them diving at the site. An implosion is a sudden, violent inward collapsing of something, in this case the diving vessel. The cause of this was the very large pressure of the water acting on the surface of the vessel to the point where the structure catastrophically failed. What I really wanted to do here is provide people a sort of intuitive idea using a simple illustration and basic math of what sort of forces these deep diving submersibles need to handle and why these maneuvers are so dangerous. So imagine we've got some submersible vessel like a submarine exploring the bottom of the ocean, thousands of feet from the surface. Now imagine us drawing a column of water one inch wide by one inch long that runs all the way from the water surface to somewhere on the surface of the submarine. Now imagine the weight of all that water in that column pushing down on that one by one inch path of surface of the sub. Let's do the math on that. The weight of water is about 0 0.036 pounds per cubic inch. The depth of the Titanic wreck is about 12,500 feet. So that works out to be around 150,000 inches. And so the weight of a one inch by one inch by 150,000 inch column of water is 5,400 pounds. So that's 5,400 pounds per square inch acting on the surface of the vessel. Now imagine those columns of water completely covering the entire surface area of the sub. It's a tremendous amount of force the vessel needs to be designed for. If there's any structural compromise that is either uh, there to start with or that develops over time due to the cycles of the sub descending and ascending from those depths uh, multiple times, it's going to result in catastrophic failure. It would have happened uh, very quickly and we could only hope uh, the passengers uh, weren't really aware of what was happening. I'm going to link to another video of an interview with James Cameron, the famous Titanic movie director who has a uh, great knowledge of, of deep sea diving, exploration and vessel design. He's got great insight into the events surrounding this tragedy in the second half of that video, including some uh, technical criticisms about the Ocean Gate submersibles um, design. Uh, very interesting. Uh, I recommend you watch that. Uh, that's it for this video. Until next time, keep tinkering.